Most septic systems consist of at least a septic tank and a drainage area. Every time you do the laundry, wash the dishes, flush the toilet, the wastewater from your house runs into your septic tank. The purpose of a septic tank is to retain the solid materials and keep them from flowing out into the drain field. The tank is basically a separation chamber where waste materials have time to settle from the water. Inside the tank, lighter materials like oil and grease float to the top, forming a scum layer, while heavier waste materials sink to the bottom, forming a sludge layer. These solids build up in your tank until it needs pumping, usually every three to five years, depending on use. For every gallon that enters the tank, another gallon exits, so it's important that whatever leaves the tank be free of solid materials. The fluid exiting the tank is called effluent. The separation of solids allows effluent to flow or be pumped into a drain field, where it can seep slowly back into the soil. The soil naturally treats the effluent before it goes back into the water table.